Please. Now, actually, it's time for my favourite part of the show. Which is? Our surprise Style Squad makeover. Uh, so far, we have actually managed to pull it off perfectly. I have. Yes. Style Squad are tackling you, Tina Freeman. Ooh. Yes. Here we go. I'm never going to cut up like this. It's going to be me oh. right now. <laughs> Just look different. <laughs> <laughs> that is so lovely. Oh, you look wonderful. Daughter Layla has nominated you for a makeover. <laughs> uh, it's a lot different than we work for. <laughs> Haven't they all looked brilliant? They've looked great. Star Squad, they are truly wonderful at what they yeah. do. And they've enjoyed it all as well. They so have. we're about to do it all over again. Yes, as always, our Star Squad stylist Darren, makeup man Mikey, and hairstylist Mark are standing by, ready to pounce on, yes, the lady in question, who may add is actually not a million miles away from where we're standing mm. right now, Jen. No. Uh, well, she thinks she's here for a tour of ITV Studios. Zoe Marriott, it's you. So turn around and meet your Star Squad. <laughs> <laughs> So, hello. How are you? Okay. You're in shock. You're in safe hands. We're going to look after you. Okay. Darren, is it happy oh. shock? This is, I think this is. I think this is happy shock. Good well, news. All I can say is you've got pampering awaits, which is brilliant. We're going to do your hair, your makeup, everything. Oh, oh Zoe, God. did you have any you. idea this was going on? I mean, no. you, we've got you completely by surprise. Just oh, something me. This is. This is. Is this amazing? Yep. Amazing. Carolyn, you, you're responsible for this. Tell us Me why. Me and Maisie. You and Maisie? Yeah. Why did you nominate Zoe? Um, because she's been really good to me. Oh. She's looked after me. And What's happening? Me and Maisie. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> and Mark, I've got to ask you, Zoe always wears her hair tied back. Yeah. So what are you going to do? I think let's bring, let's bring Zoe's hair out. I think she's got great <laughs> length there. Let's leave it long, but let's get it moving and, and let's add some glamour in there. OK, and Darren, you're going to get uh, the, the leggings off because apparently uh, Zoe's a cleaner and she's forever wearing the leggings. So you are you going to get freer of those? I'm going to have a look at these leggings. You've great legs. Yeah. We're, we're going to play around with it. We might go for something a little bit more tailored. Um, I, I believe another a sin of yours is the fact that you never wear heels. And I know flats yeah. are comfortable, but, we're, you know, we're going to try a little heel. Leg length and effects. They look really good, particularly with your legs. Uh, thank you. <laughs> and Mikey, obviously makeup's a big deal. And, it is uh, the biggest just... deal, isn't it? I can feel a pulse through Carolyn's back. That's a good sign. Mm. Um, you've got the most amazing blue eyes, so I think we're going to enhance. I think a little bit smoky. Okay. There's a bit of a wedding coming up, so I'm yeah. going to give you some yeah. tips so you can take home and hopefully do it yourself. All right, thank you. Cool. Yeah, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Are you looking forward to it? I am, yeah. Yep, I think. <laughs> and you've got a twin, though, as well, don't you? I have, yep. Mum, tell us, what's the deal with the identical twins, but very no, no, not identical, um, but Amy, a twin, never goes out without slap on and looking really lovely. And it's always just the complete yeah. opposite. And then for Maisie, obviously, it's going to be a big change to see it her is, yeah. up. Yeah, it will be. <laughs> well, there we go. Thank you very much, Style Squad. Do your best tonight, as you always we do. Uh, Maisie's going to enjoy this one as well. Oh, Maisie's uh, going, what's going yeah, on? Yeah, so the Style Squad are going off and uh, work their magic. I can't wait to see the end result. It's going to be a great one today. Brilliant. It'll be really good. Oh. And the, the time's ticking now, because that was about an hour ago, Jen. So uh, it's over to the Style Squad HQ to see how Darren, Mikey and Mark are getting on. Guys, how's it going? Going well. Yeah, brilliant. Mark, how are you getting on with Zoe's hair? Because she always does a ponytail, doesn't she? I've got to say, Zoe's loving this. We've added a little bit of volume. We're going to add some real glamour in there. Um, we've got a top, t a top tip to take home. Just add a little bit of dry shampoo and let the, let the curls happen. She's looking great. OK, I might try that. Uh, Mikey, <laughs> Zoe never wears makeup. Have you managed to persuade her to put a little bit on? Very easily, in fact. She wears a bit of mascara, so we're thinking of the wedding, so to give her some tips to be able to do the makeup herself. My take-home tip is to match your foundation. I'll use you, Mark. I would put three colour swatches on the jawline. The one that disappears and blends with the neck is the colour that we're going to go with. So that is the top tip. Oh, that's a very Thank useful you. tip. Thank we you, should my take darling. Heed Darren? Of that, mm. Jeff. Yeah, Darren, can you give us any clues about what Zoe might be wearing? Oh, well, I'll give you some clues. I mean, last week we looked at tailoring for men. This week we're going to show you how you can be glamorous every day. I mean, Zoe's a mum. So my top tip is do not reserve glamour for special occasions. You can be a mum and still have a little bit of glamour in everyday life. 
OK, guys, we've less than an hour to go and we know every second counts, so we're going to leave it to you. Yes, go for it. Absolutely. So the time has come. It's the moment we've all been waiting for. Yeah, earlier this morning, we surprised 23-year-old mum of one, Zoe Marriott, with a makeover of a lifetime. Now, Zoe actually thought, we fooled her, that she was here on an ITV studio tour, but that was just a big fat lie. I saw her line. standing in the corner. She was minding her own business and <laughs> the was. shock that actually hit her face. Zoe's mum, Carolyn, had secretly nominated Zoe, claiming that life as a cleaner had robbed her daughter of glamour. Oh, we will be revealing the new Zoe in a moment, but first, let's hear from the Style Squad, who have been working their magic all morning. OK, so, uh, Mikey, Zoe only wore minimal I makeup. Know. Disappointing for me. But Cinderella is going to go to the ball. Forget the cleaning. Okay. Um, I've given her a lot of tips today. I'm thinking about the brother's wedding that's coming up. So hopefully something she's going to be able to do at home. I've done a little VT to break it down. And let's see how we can make some smoky eyes she can do herself. Mm, let's. let's check it out. Smoky eyes never go out of fashion, but they're notoriously hard to achieve yourself at home. Easiest way to achieve this is to start with a gel liner, blending that through, backwards and forwards, almost like a windscreen wiper. I'm going to add into this a shadow. The key is to really work the colour into the brush and then work it into your hand. I'm going to add the purple into the crease. And I'm going to go for a black gel. I'm going to start to sketch all the way across, using the brush to make it thicker towards the outer edge. And you're going to push the liner up onto the flesh line. I'm going to use a pencil brush. We're going to sweep this underneath the lash line. This, again, is really going to make the eyes look bigger and add that drama. And I think that completes our summer sexy eyes. Very sexy, sexy but you don't have Very to necessarily sexy. do blue. You don't, but I have done a colour today that shows, you know, colour is wearable, it is easy. Don't be scared. OK, OK. Wonderful stuff, Mikey. Thanks. Educational and informative. <laughs> Fabulous, exactly. <laughs> Mark, uh, tell us about the hair. It was um, usually worn back. It's been coloured quite a lot, hasn't it? So what kind of condition was it in to begin with? Well, th we haven't actually cut Zoe's hair, and I've, I've come up with something that is so quick and so easy to get at home. I'm, I'm really excited about this. Is for that because she wouldn't let you cut it? Uh, no, it's because she's got beautiful long hair, but she always wears it tied back. So I thought, let's let's do something really quick, something that when she's at home, she can do and she can go out. Uh, I'm not going to give it away, but think Katy Perry. And I guess Ooh. it's quite topical today, but I must ask, did you have to trim any any um, armpit hair as well? <laughs> Only Mikey's. <laughs> Only, <laughs> Only a trim. A trim. He does his every day. <laughs> anyway, here's Mark's top ten hair products that you just should not do without. products at home and Darren have you managed to get her out the leggings do you know what I she's been such a dream to work with and the thing is she's a hard-working mom I wanted to mm. give her some glamour but on her terms because you know what I think if you've got a two-year-old running around you're busy going to work it needs to be something that's accessible my top tip is to get a good statement blazer that's just gonna sharpen up a simple t-shirt and jeans yeah no absolutely okay then so this is it yep we've heard how they've done it how does she look? Style Squad ready? Oh, yes. yeah. Carolyn ready. ready? Yeah. Jeff ready? I'm ready. Go on. Let's see if Zoe's ready. Zoe, come on in. Oh, yay! Yeah. Give her a round of applause. Woo. Zoe, oh. you look incredible. You look fantastic. How do you feel? I feel great. I do feel great. I can't wait to see myself. Oh, uh, do you love the blazer? Because um, Darren said that that was something that was going to suit you very much. Yeah, I do. Well, yeah, I love it. I love everything. And the oh. colours? Yep. Look at your legs, they're amazing. Let's just have a little look at what you looked like when you arrived, OK? And compare that with you now. Oh, my goodness. That is incredible, <laughs> Wonderful Carolyn. transformation, that is. Carolyn, what do you think? Gorgeous. I didn't recognise her. Uh. <laughs> oh. It's so nice That's to see you like that. I've got to ask the guys, come on, you've got to talk us through what you've done here, starting with Mark. Let's discuss this beautiful hair. Well, this is something that's so easy to get Did you do home. dry shampoo? Uh, I, a I little bit of dry shampoo, it. just because that holds the look a bit better. Yeah. But I, I wrapped it round a wand, and then the oldest... Well, one of the oldest tricks that we use on shoots all the time, we throw the head forward, and when we kind of throw it back, and then we fix it in place. So right. it's, it's very now very Katy Perry. Is so that is that called zhuzhin? I think it is, yeah. That's the, the general term you is were, judging. always wanted to know. He was doing <laughs> some judging yeah, earlier, weren't you? <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, Mikey, with the eyes, uh, what colour is that? 
I know, shock horror, purple, mm. shock. Um, you can see, I know, closer nice. look. You can see she's got mum's eyes, the most amazing blue colour eyes. So, you know, we can all wear brown, it's very boring. So purple has added that splash of colour. For the wedding, you're going to wear a coral, so you said, yeah. or like a peach. Yeah, peach. So again, this is going to look amazing at the wedding. It's something she can create at home. Yeah, and obviously the clothes look great as well. Mm. Darren? Do you know, Zoe's just so pretty. And, you know, a dress and heels always looks great, but I wanted to give Zoe some pieces that will really help her build on her wardrobe. And I think that's what we've done, you know, you love your leggings and we kind of said right we're not going to alienate you but what i want to do is put you in a sharper jegging you still got the comfort factor you can still move around after Maisie, but they're sharper looking and you love your converse i mean the jeggings are only um 14.99 from new look which is a really really bargain you love your converse you can wear them with this look as well but we've gone for a stacked a uh, boot from it's Zara. Not too high a heel either. So no, it's... no, that's fine. Because you were afraid fine. you'd fall. Yes, I was very. <laughs> and you walk perfectly. <laughs> They're fifty nine ninety nine from Zara, and then the blazer, obviously, which is the key piece. I love that. White is very summery. You could go black. You could go for a trophy colour if you want. But we kept the colour neutral in the blazer and popped that nice little salmon top underneath. The blazer itself is M and S oh. fifty nine pounds. You're still going to have to Great. stay away from Maisie guys. with that jacket yeah, because no. she's <laughs> going to have her like oh. dirty hands. Oh, no. um, yes. Well, we've all seen you, Zoe. It's being unfair if we didn't actually reveal yourself to uh, to yourself so if you was just to come, come to down here. to the end here okay you ready yeah okay three two one so it's the new you oh yeah oh, what do you think don't cry. Try not to. no you can no i'm okay and oh, it's no. little Maisie, Maisie. to see mummy I wonder whether Maisie's got anything to say about oh. Mummy's new look. Uh, come over, come over come here. Over here darling. Come over here so we can come see on, you a bit here. better. Here okay. Maisie, does Mummy look really gorgeous and beautiful? Yeah. Yes, Aww. she does. She looked gorgeous and beautiful anyway, didn't she? But now she looks super gorgeous. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Very, very cute. Zoe, indeed. how do you feel now that I feel great, honestly. I'm really thankful. Thank you for everything. You're Thank you. Thank you. Oh, do you want me to hold your bag? Yes, can you can do. <laughs> Zoe, do you, you think, do you think this is something you're going to be able to maintain and do we create for the wedding yeah, you're going to? Yeah, I do hope so, yeah. I'm going to try. Yes, oh, they are flowers. So, yes. Well, look, you know. To... Yeah, you got <laughs> to finish the day off well, we have a little extra surprise for you all. We're going to send you all for afternoon tea at the Cadogan Hotel in Knightsbridge. So um, you're going to finish off a stylish morning. Yeah, you have a wonderful time, Thank guys. You. And thank you very much for being such a good thank style you. squad. You've done an incredible job again. Uh, if somebody wants to get this look, um, what would you advise? Where would they go? My advice, my advice would be to start with one piece, which is the tailored blazer, and then work away. The great thing about this look is every single piece is going to be interchangeable with the rest of her wardrobe. So they're all hard-working separates. That is the key. Oh. OK, Mike, in with regards to the makeup again, just to... I summarize. think what I'm going to do, because I get so many tweets and, like, where do we get the product? So I'll actually do a list. I'll do a little picture of Zoe and we'll pop it on the website, hopefully. Fantastic. Yes. And also, Mark, you know, with the hair, you don't have to have a radical cut. You can still make it look different. Yeah, without very cutting. Easily. I mean, Zoe's going to keep her hair long for the wedding. Wrap it round a, a wand, throw your head forward, and you've got these really nice... Bit of zhuzhing and we're there. A little, a little bit of zhuzhing. Guys, thank you very much. Thank Style you. Squad, you've been You're incredible welcome. again. As always, you have been great. Thank Fantastic. you. Fantastic.